nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And the tension is palpable because we've reached the semi-final stage of the UEFA Women's Champions League. This, the first leg. It's Wolfsburg, and they take on Arsenal. This should be a great tactical battle. Which team is going to have the courage to try and win the game, and which team will be fearful of losing? The game plan of each coach will certainly be key today, Derek. So we can check on the starting lineup. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. And so they start at 11 for Arsenal. Thank you. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. And this confrontation is underway. Might really be able to trouble them here. Well, disappointing end to the move. Leah Williamson. Eva Payor. And ball back with Arsenal now. Promising attack, this. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Little. Mornum. Promising sequence. Katie McCabe. This looks threatening. Well read to ease the pressure. Hood. and making headway oh she's in a really promising position and the keeper there to deal with it and clears the danger takes it on well the keeper had to concentrate Now, how about the short corner? A fine block. Svenja Hood. And successfully cut out. No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. Couldn't keep it. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. And let's give credit to the defending.
Can she find the right pass? Intense pressure. Poor pass. And they need to get tighter here. Well, possibilities in the centre. Great block. Well cleared away, but at the expense of a corner. favoured a short one here and the cross not quite imaginative enough something to worry about here real chance great reflex action well that should have been a goal mind you it's a brilliant save well they fancy a short one And the keeper more than equal to the task. No worries for the keeper. Wienreuter. Stina Blackstenius. And outboxing her opponent. It has to be! Oh, remarkable save! Well, it's great reflexes from the goalkeeper. She had no right to make that save. Who can they pick out? And still dangerous. Firing is in. And a body in the way. An opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. Well, not cleared away completely. And in the end, no damage done. Breaking at pace. Slipshod passing. Well, she's playing with a purpose. It might be the moment to get them ahead. And there it is! The first goal in the semi-final! A huge moment! Extraordinary scenes! Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. So the ball rolling again, with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Latvine trying to really get at the opposition here well play stopped it is a free kick well the referee deciding that it didn't warrant a yellow card being handed out Trailing, but hope in the form of a corner.
and played short played into the center read it superbly to take back possession this might be ideal for the counter well they seem to be onto something positive but it faded away chances on oh masterful defending to prevent what looked like a certain goal useful looking ball it did look on for them but not to be always going to be the goalkeeper's ball and the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time oh great attacking play can she put it away and that is textbook goalkeeping. Well, she made it look so difficult for the striker. That's a really good stop from the keeper. Great positioning. They favoured a short one here. Raffaele. This is looking threatening. It might be. And a decent save. Full credit. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. And so they begin the second half. Arsenal hold the advantage presently. Tremendous ball played through. Really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. Delivering it. A decisive clearance it was. This might have potential. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Frida Mornu. Kim Little. Well, keeping hold of the ball is what it's all about for them. McCabe. Oh, she's made a crucial tackle there. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. And she might be in. Well, a one-versus-one one situation, but sadly, no end product. Well, when you're in those situations, you've got to make the right decision, and I'm not sure it was the right decision. She could have bent it round the keeper there. Little. Stina Blackstenius. Poor attempt at a pass, really. A potential danger here. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Looking for that final pass and for that chance to level the game. Tremendous block. Oh, a golden opportunity for her. A goal! 
Real excitement, a back and forth type of game. Now they're level. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb. And just look at that finish. 1v1 against the keeper, and she hits it with power. It's a great goal. So back underway, one goal apiece here. Katie McCabe. Well, not giving the opposition a look in, that's strong play. But just like that, possession changes hands. Just not looking confident in possession. She has teammates around her. Good use of advantage by the referee. Arsenal doing well to regain possession. McCabe. Kim Little. Oh, good vision. Real chance. Can they stop it going in? Really good interception. Well, the keeper deserves a lot of credit. That was a fine save, wasn't it? An encouraging Arsenal move. Well, showing excellent judgment to intercept. So this is Jay Cheatham. Happy birthday, Jay. Applying vigorous pressure. No way through. And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. Well, play was allowed to carry on, but now that it's come to a halt, a caution. And a substitution in the offing. Lena Latwein, real chance. And there is the goal to re establish their advantage. Well, let's have another look because this is a goal they have thoroughly deserved. They've played really well so far. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Lena Oberdorf. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Down by a goal. This could be the final opportunity to snatch something. Roared! High quality goalkeeping and still they lead. Well, that's a great save. That could be the match winning stop there. They fancy a short one. This could be the equaliser. Well, how close was that? Inches away.
And that was a move of great promise. They could easily have been in. This could be it! Oh, good reflexes from the keeper and the danger averted. And time for the change now. They favoured a short one here. Always going to be the goalkeeper's ball. Jill Ward. Raffaele. Lia Velti. And support available. But really sticking to the task defensively. An incisive pass. Just needs to stay calm. Oh, it's in! And that might be the goal that clinches it for them. No looking back now, surely. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And the finish is really good. She just smashes that past the keeper. That's a top quality goal. Now well, the action continues, and no shortage of goals. 3-1 as things stand. Pop. Now with Roard. Oh, lovely incisive pass. Oh, remarkable save! Well, it's great reflexes from the goalkeeper. She had no right to make that save. Corner kick played in. Oh, that's a fine save. Well, not cleared away completely. And there goes the final whistle. It's a victory for the visitors in the first leg of this tie. Well, it was a great performance, wasn't it? You could see the game plan from the first minute, and they executed it so well. Surely they'll be moving into the final with another display like that.